as you expand. So uh, the when I go to my, I want to do a calculation because the coin that I received for this, um, I want to check the balance. Okay, I think yesterday I received. Um, okay, this is the use of coin that I received. 0 0.047 so i've used 0. Um, i got this account the person the person's coin that I minted was 0 0.0471 so i've already used 0 0.0201 zero one two three to fill to buy i use this amount here i use this amount here to buy the psu x light package so the balance i'm having is zero point zero two six nine seven seven so now this video i want to show us how to do your calculation now you know um the PSUX you need 0 0.002 to feed that farm. Let me shift this here. You need 0 0.02 to fill the PSUX farm. The PSUX farm is 0 0.002. That is the max load. That's the capacity of the farm. You can see it's a 0 0.002. So you need to know how much. PSU, how much PSU do I need to feed that farm? So, how do you do that? You go to coins bits, go to coins bits because you need to have a verified coins bit account if you want to. Because PSU X is listed only and it's been traded only on coins bits, so you must have a coins bit account if you want to be. Uh, withdrawing trading PSUX and filling your farm, you need to have a cosmic account. So, I'll go to let me click this three line. I'll go to buy crypto, go to classic sport trading. I'll go to classic sport trading. So, I'll wait for it to load to open. I'm waiting for it to open. So that's open. So when you want to trade PSUX, you need to come here. You come here. Click this PSU dash USDT. You click that. Then you search for the P. The P where the root search here. You search for P. Inside here, PSU X. You can see PSU X. You use the search from here, here, inside this hole here. That's where you search. So now I want to show us the calculation because the calculation is somehow tricky. So the calculation, it has turned back to PSU now. So I have to, okay, I'm not click it. I'll click here, PSU X slash. PSU because you need to first uh, if you want to use PSU to buy PSUX uh, PSUX you need to have already used you can see PSUX already pumping it's moving up you need to have already used USD to buy PSU after using USD to buy PSU then I have another video on that on how to use USD to buy PSU then you need to allow move the PSU to your trade wallet section the PSU must be on your trade on, on in its trade wallet it must not be in main wallet it must be on the trade wallet I don't think uh, let me check I don't think my PSU is on the trade wallet so I need to go to wallet first go to balance let's go to balance consider the PSU X is already pumping, it's moving up. It's moving up. 
So I want to open uh, I want to open I don't know why it's opening, but that's the way it comes to be behaved. It will always be hanging. This video might take time because I want to show us the process of um okay it has opened now you can see that my psu ultima is on the it's still on the main wallet it's on the main wallet i i seen it so the unit of the coin that you want to use i need to put it here so i need like um 0.0198 so okay let me move everything there so that you see um because i've done my calculation the balance that remains is a 0.026. So I need to move. I'm not moving on because I need some amount for gas fee. Let me see. I need some amount for gas fee. On my nozzle. Zero. Okay. One nine eight. Okay. Let me move 0 0.0198. I know what I'm doing that. I will explain why I'm doing that. 0 0.01 because I have several coins there, so I don't want to mismanage it. So I want to move 0 0.0198 PLCU to trade. I'll click transfer. I'll click transfer. I'll click transfer. Okay, so you see it's, it's move down here. It's a move to that trade wallet, trade wallet section to move. Why is it taking long like this? Just to transfer. Okay, it has moved. So since I since I have an available balance there. 0 0.0198 in the true wallet section. When I go back to the menu, I'll go back to classic sport trading. I'll go to buy crypto classic sport trading. Okay, you see here now. You can see that my PSCU is showing here. It's showing there. So this is the calculation. Now I need how many P how many PS okay? I need uh, you type 0 0.002 here. You can see. That means I will need a total of um wow 0 0.036 PSU. Wow. I need the total of 0 0.036 PSU. And what I have is 0 0.0198. So anyway, I use what I because that's what I have. I'll use zero point zero one nine eight. So since so that means so can I say now that if you want to buy the light farm, just use the same calculation for every other package. You if you want to fill PSUX farm, you need zero point zero zero two PSUX to fill the light farm. So it's not showing the value, the unit of PSU you, you need to have. To buy 0 0.002 PSUX. But from my experience, the last time I did this, when I did the withdrawal, it was charged. So you can put like 0 0.021 for charges. For charges. When you withdraw to your farm, it might reduce. So you can put like one day. So that means you need 0 0.0378 PSU to buy 0 0.0021. So now, what is the value of that 0 0.0378 in dollars? So 0. Point, as I now as I recording this video, one PSU is around um okay, I don't have my wallet here. It's around 54. Around 54. So that means 0 0.0378. 378 times 54. That means I need uh, 204 dollars worth of I need to earn four dollar to buy PSU worth zero point zero three seven eight. 
to buy the PSU X. But now my value balance it is the method of how to calculate. Let's say you want to buy the 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 air package. Air package is 0 0.005 the mass load. That means you need 0 0.09 PSU to buy PSU X of 0 0.005. See, here. so that means you need um using to this value now you need 0 0.09. Let's change it to 0 0.0 become 0 0.09 9 what 9 9 0 times that means you need about 486 dollar to buy PSU to be able to buy uh, 0 0.005 PSU if I go to the site if I go to the site I want to show something I should go to the site If I go to the site, see the other farm packages here. The light, you can see the starter is 0 0.01. So if I put 0, if I want to buy um, PSUX 0 0.01, you will see what it will show us. Someone is calling me. I need to tell the person I'm recording a video. Sorry for that, I'm recording. So, okay, this has open. So, if let's say you want to buy the starter package that is um, 0 0.01 PSUX. Just type zero inside the where the root amount PSU is type 0 0.01 PSU is now show you how many PSU you, you need to be able to buy 0 0.01 PSU. So I've taught us how to do that. So now then I and if you want to buy United changes, so I've used this limit order, this limit to show us the calculation. So if now I, I want to now buy now. I will not change that limit here to market. So since I have 0 0.0198, I will just click 100% here. I'll click 100%. I'll click 100% because I want to use all. Then I'll now click buy. Click buy. Click buy. So I think to market. Click buy. Because it has given me 0 0.01068. Wow. Almost as about half. So it has bought for me. So I will now I get the PSUX. Where will it be? Go to 33 line again. Go to your wallet. Go to your balance. Go to your balance. Go to your balance. It will now show at the it will show at the PSUX section it will show at the PSUX section people, most people yet yeah, they've not even really understood how the PSU works so that's why I'm building this video on how to not even know how to use PSUX so I will not click that search button inside that search button I will type PSUX to bring it.